Hey everyone, I'm Nick de la Torre and welcome to Awaken the Word. Today we're reading from the Gospel of Matthew. Then the disciples of John came to him saying, Why do we and the Pharisees fast often, but your disciples do not fast? And Jesus said to them, The wedding guests cannot mourn as long as the bridegroom is with them, can they? The days will come when the bridegroom is taken away from them, and then they will fast. All right, so here we have the disciples of John the Baptist approaching our Lord and asking, why are your followers living a more laxed life than we are? We're over here fasting and it's tough and we're doing all this to be, you know, close to God and holy and whatnot. And your disciples are all just kind of kicking it and having fun and following you around and camping. And what's the deal here, Lord? What's really interesting about this is if you consider our Lord as the bridegroom, who then is the bride in this analogy? It's us. It's the church. So really, we're talking about not only guests of this wedding, but the bride of this wedding. How can the bride mourn when she is with the bridegroom? And if you consider for us as Catholics, when we go to Mass, the holy sacrifice of the Mass, the sacred liturgy, and we are present for this awesome occasion, the consecration of the Eucharist, where where heaven kisses earth, and and our blessed Lord is brought to us in this Eucharistic form, when we are with him physically, our bridegroom, we as the bride, and we are with him, what a powerful and incredible thing. What I get the most excited about when I consider these things, and so much of this, by the way, is expounded upon very profoundly by uh, Pope St. John Paul II in his Theology of the Body, and since then by so many others who are writing and reflecting on that masterpiece, such as Christopher West. What stands out to me the most, what I get the most excited about, is our eternal destiny as the bride to that bridegroom, to the the divine bridegroom, Jesus Christ, blessed be his name. The profound meaning that that has for us and our union with him, and, and the ways in which marriage, human marriage here on earth, is, is meant to point us to this eternal, incredible reality that is so far beyond it. It's so much to get excited about, so much to be jubilant about. And we get little taste of that, that intimate connection with him in communion, in holy communion, in the mass. I have been Nick. This has been Awaken the Word. And before you go, I just need you to know that Jesus loves you. Peace. Thank you for tuning in to Awaken the Word. Awaken the Word is a three-minute daily show that unpacks scripture with practical messages for everyday life. Awaken the Word is made in partnership by Spoke Street Media and Awaken Catholic.